Hello everyone. Welcome back to Dr. Gordon's Medical Coding Classes. So today I am going to tell you about Chapter 5 Mental, Behavioral and Neurodevelopmental Disorders. So this chapter is of the code range F01 to F99 that is F series. So first one is Pain Disorders Related to Psychological Factors. Here there is mainly two codes F45.41 and F45.42. So first one you can see F45.41 pain exclusively related to psychological disorders. So actually here they are uh, describing about two types of pain. First one is physical pain and the second one is psychological pain. So what is the difference between physical pain and psychological pain? Physical pain is that pain uh, which is caused physically that is uh, the pain that is caused due to some injuries or trauma that is considered as physical pain. So what will be a psychological pain? Psychological pain can be otherwise called emotional pain or mental pain. Okay, there is no actual physical pain that is psychological pain. Okay, so moving on to the first code F45.41. Pain exclusively related to psychological disorder, which means there is no physical pain, only psychological pain is there. Then we have to code F45.41. The second code F45.42 means pain disorders with related psychological factors. That is the patient is having both physical pain as well as psychological pain. Now you can see. Uh, the first one F45.41 G89 is excludes 1. So this G89 actually describes about the uh, acute or chronic pain. Okay, about if the pain is acute or chronic pain. Okay, this G89 is applicable for physical pain only. So as F45.41 do not have physical pain. So, G89 is excludes 1 of F45.41. Okay, what was excludes 1? Excludes 1 means that two codes should never come together. No, so F45.41 and G89 should never come together. Okay, and in the second case, F45.42, in that case, G89 can come with F45.42. Okay, that is if the uh, if the physical pain is of acute or chronic type, if it is mentioned, then you can code uh, along with F45.42, you can code G89 also. Okay. Then the next one is mental and behavioral disorders due to psychoactive substance use. So, what is psychoactive substance? I'll give examples. Uh, alcohol, then tobacco, opioid heroin okay such addictive substances are psychoactive substance okay and uh, here we are discussing about disorders mental as well as behavioral disorders due to use of the psychoactive substance like alcohol okay so the code for this psychoactive uh, substance use disorders is from f10 to f19 okay Here one guideline is that in remission. What is in remission? In remission means resolving or curing stage. Okay. So uh, if the condition, if the disorder is clinically specified as alcohol use in remission or tobacco use in remission or uh, nicotine use in remission, if it if it's specifically uh, stated as in remission, then we have to use the fourth and fifth characters as 0.11 or 0.21. Okay, so if it is alcohol use in remission means F10.11 or F10.21, like that. Okay, the second point requires provider's clinical judgment. That is, the provider should clearly specify that the disorder is in remission. Okay, then only we can use this uh, 0.11 or 0.21. Next one is psychoactive substance use, abuse and dependence. So, use, abuse and dependence. You may know what is use and what is abuse. Using in a bad way. 
and what is dependence uh, in a condition that he cannot live without that dependent he is dependent okay so use abuse and dependence of same psychoactive substance if same psychoactive substance use abuse or dependence is mentioned in the same chart then we have to use only one code i will tell more clearly if taking an example if in the patient chart it is described as both alcohol use as well as alcohol abuse then you have to code only one code either alcohol use or alcohol abuse so which one we should take is in that three red bulletin it is given okay the first one is use and abuse if both use and abuse is given then we have to code for abuse only okay if the condition given is abuse and dependence then you have to code for dependence only and the third one is if it is use and dependence code only for dependence that is always code for the more severe condition okay then the next guideline is psychoactive substance use unspecified that is the psychoactive substance use or abuse or dependence what what is the condition if it is not specified then we can take point 9 okay after the category code then you can take as point 9 psychoactive substance use unspecified if 10 to f19.9 like that then the last topic factitious disorder or munchausen's syndrome so the factitious disorder is otherwise called munchausen syndrome so this factitious disorder there are of two types factitious disorder on self and factitious disorder on proxy okay so what is factitious disorder on self first of all its code is f68.1 then what does it mean person falsely reports his or her own physical or psychological signs or symptom that is if a patient tells to doctor that he is having some abnormalities some physical or psychological abnormalities which he actually does not have okay he is falsely reporting signs or symptoms okay that condition is called factitious disorder on self it is actually a psychological disorder okay so the factitious disorder on self the code is f68.1 so what is factitious disorder on proxy if self means he is telling his own then on proxy means he is telling about some other person okay which means a person falsely report physical or psychological signs or symptom about another person then it is called factitious disorder on proxy the code for factitious disorder on proxy is f68.8 okay so in factitious disorder on proxy there is actually two people no one who tells the signs or symptoms and one about whom this is telling no the second person is called the victim and the first person who is telling is called the perpetrator okay here the code for factitious disorder on proxy is given to the perpetrator okay who is telling about whom that who is Uh, applicable for the factitious disorder on proxy code f68.8 okay so the second person is called victim okay and the victim he receives the code for adult or child abuse neglect and maltreatment suspected or confirmed okay if the condition is suspected then he will receive that code then if it is the condition is confirm then he will receive that code t74 or t76 so factitious disorder is of two types on self and on proxy on self means the person falsely report his or her own physical or psychological symptom and on proxy means the person falsely report about someone else okay so that's all for this chapter it's a very small chapter if you have any doubt means you can ask in the comment section thank you